Hey everyone, it's Tyler and Michelle Strike from Universal Rackets, and today we're going to be doing a drilling session. Yes. We're going to be going over what? Dinks, um, and we're going to do drills on the dink, and then we're also going to do resets. So let's get started. So the first thing we do is we start a timer for 10 minutes, and we will warm up just by hitting <laughs> forehand dinks for 10 minutes. And if you miss, you just keep going, and all forehand dinks. Then, once you complete your 10 minutes of your warm-up forehand, then you get into the games. Now, instead of playing till 11-0, zero, uh, zero, what we do is we do a different scoring system. So explain it, Ty. So, a lot of players, when they do these drills, if you get down 8-0, you're probably not going to try, or it's probably not going to be as motivating. So what we do, it's the first player to get three balls in a row, or three points in a row. So it doesn't allow one person to get up on a streak, like 10-0, 8-0, whatever. So again, I have to win three in a row. So she won one right there. <laughs> okay, so we're starting. So you're up 1-0. Now again, if she loses a point though, then you get canceled and it's automatically over, okay? So she's up 1-0. She needs to win two more to win this first game. And we'll probably play a couple of games. All right. So now it's zero because she was up one. I beat her. I don't get a point. I just reset it. Now whoever has to win three in a row. Got Here we are. And it's all dinks. All right. So one zero me. No speed ups, just dinks. And then if someone pops it up, you can attack that, but you're not going to just speed up under the net. Oh, shoot. Ooh, two zero. You know how I feel about that shot. You need to be moving in your footwork, honey. Two zero me. So if I win this point, I win. It was in. I was going to say. I was going to call it out. I was but going to it say. Was in. Yes. That's right. We're going to have a. You're going to be walking home after that one. All right. So Except now I, I won myself. three in a row right there. <laughs> so I would get the first game, like it would be like a game, kind of like tennis. So you have games and then sets. I don't know if you want to say tennis on a pickleball camp, but that's okay. So it's 1-0 in games, okay? So we'll play best out of five, okay? Do you want to stay forehand or do you want to switch to backhand? We could go to backhand. I kind of want to just feel the ball in the forehand because I haven't played in forever. I've been on, on a hiatus and uh, resting because I injured my shoulder. So this is probably the first time I'm actually playing pickleball and not recording in Ow. probably like a month and a half. Okay. It's crazy. So I just want so to get it. My main thing when taking time off, so it's zero again, is just getting a feel for the ball, getting back into a rhythm, trying to stay at the kitchen, taking balls out of air. I realize I haven't been doing that right now, but that's okay. Like there it's again. It's kind of hard oh, to, um, that was going out. So that's really my point. Okay. Two zero you. I w it's kind of hard to teach while you're drilling. It right? is. And people are always like, oh, well, could you demonstrate while you teach? It's like, no, I, I get out of breath. I'm too out of shape and old to be talking and teaching. Come on, Ty. All right, zeros. Here we are. Back to zero. Ended our two streak. Trying to make contact down front. I'm making contact way too close to my body. I like making a run. There we are. Have a run up. Run over here. A little bit over here. Oh, ah, that's what you on. get. I got too cocky. Too All cocky. Right. One zero. Yeah. <laughs> ones or no sorry zeros you're gonna count that for your point yeah it was my point you hit it out okay. it's only half court one me two me and my big thing uh. by taking time off personally from playing pickleball is i've played tennis for 20 years right so my mindset and my body my muscle memory still automatically reverts to tennis. So a big thing that I'm realizing is I'm taking my paddle back a little bit. I have to make sure I keep my paddle out front from the start to go to pickleball. I need to eliminate that tennis muscle memory. Oh shoot. Oh no. Like that. All right. Zeros. So sore. I went to the gym first time yesterday as well. So sore. That was tennis. Bait. One you. <laughs> I like my new Skechers though. They look sick on you. Oh, come on. Two I win. Zero. That was, that was two. Really? Yeah, it was two. Is anyone else keeping score? <laughs> Can't speed up, I forgot. 
Right now, I'm not confident in my dinks, so I want to speed up. All right. This is the tiebreaker for all the marbles. The tiebreaker, so that was three points. So you won. Oh, okay, so we're starting so over. So it's 1-1, one, one. whoever wins this game wins. 0-0, zero, zero. good luck. Winner buys breakfast or coffee. All right, one zero. you, or a loser. You just buy everything though, so I don't know what you mean by that. All right, zero. <laughs> and for this too, if you pull someone super out wide, you're allowed to hit ATPs. So if I pull her super out wide, oh my God. I, I need to watch my videos. This is stressful, but this is good because it puts you in like an adrenaline type situation like if you were in a tournament. You just want to beat me, that's why. What is it? No, but like there's a reason one to zero, not yeah. mess up. You're not just like hitting dinks like for no reason. All right, once. Oh, shoot. All right, I lost track. Two zero you, I think. Woo! Glad I have that shot still. Here we are, zeros. Oh shoot. One. Two. So we counted off the feed? Of course. You should have made oh, that. Okay. Two. She's mad right now. She's getting super. Oh, nice game, Beth. Good game. <laughs> <laughs> and that's our drilling sash. <laughs> Tell everyone uh, about it. Now you have to do it on the backhand. Uh, so now we're going to do it on the backhand side. What time is it? 9.38. All right. I feel like it's more pickleball, less tennis. Oh! That was so rude! Like, my partner would take that ball and shove it right up your you know what. <laughs> Don't hit a high floater in the middle. <laughs> it's rude. People are saying I'm mean. Two zero, man. That was rude. <laughs> Sorry. I feel like Desky right now. Who's that? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> and just so you know, we didn't do our 10 minutes of warming up on my <laughs> left make side. excuses? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> okay, there we are. You feel better? Yeah. Zeros. <laughs> yes! One, you. Yeah. Come on! Let's go, baby. Woo! The grind. Fired up right now. Zeros. All right, let's win this quick. One zero. Yes! Two zero. That doesn't count. You sure? Yes. It does not count. Zeros. Oh! Yes! One zero. Yeah. I got it. I'm up one zero in games now. Fudge balls. So this is like stressful because you want to win, obviously, if you're I think competitive. It's be it's because it's but between us. But it's better us. than being like 11-0 for me. You know what yeah. I mean? Two zero. Yeah. Oh, plays it. Oh, yes! All right, ones. It's She's ones. Warm. In, is it ones in games? Yeah, one. All right, Not winner warm. takes all. Here we are, zeros. Yes. One zero. Yes. <laughs> I feel a lot of nerves right now, to be honest with you. Game-like situation. If you win, you lose. If you lose, you win. Or if you win, you lose. If you lose, you lose. It's like a win-lose. I don't even know. Here we are. Come, Come on, on, Ty. <laughs> See. <laughs> Let's go. Come on, zeros. Two. One. One. 
I'm gonna wait for me to be at the kitchen. It doesn't count. One. Two. It would be a lot like cooler if I could hit it one backhand dink. That was like good. Good game. I don't, I don't deserve that one. Good game. Ow. Okay, now let's do the drill for resets. The kitchen. I don't really want to do resets. Uh, so you're going to be there and I'll be here. So you'll be in transition zone and I'll be up here. And then we should um, end it, okay? Cool. Okay. So you're going to be in the transition zone. I'll be up here. And you just have to stay there. And I'm going to be offensive. So normally if she hits a good reset, she's going to move up. But in this drill, she's just going to stay there because she's working on resetting. And I'm working on being offensive as possible. So I'm working on all my speed ups, trying to not let any ball touch the ground. I, so I should never attack? No. Okay. Unless it's high, but you, you can't move. You can attack, okay. but you can't move. Because if it's a high ball and you're in the transition zone or you have an opportunity, you want to, right? Popped up, my speed ups. That was way too high. Ooh. Don't move out of the way. And I'm trying to get lower and under the ball so I can be aggressive. Ooh, it's hot. Last two. Should I let the ones go out that are going out? Not for this drill. Let's keep it going. Your goal is to get as much reps as possible. Oh. Nice, babe. Ah! Last one, last one. <laughs> that can't be the last one. Good game. And that's our drill. So again, what we did right now, a little quick drilling sesh. We worked on dinking, playing dinks with games, having to be active. Main thing when players are dinking, they're not active. They're just standing there up at the kitchen. You need to make sure that you're moving. You're continually active on court. And yeah, and you'll be better off. Also, I could do both of those drills for like 30 minutes each. Yeah. The more, the longer you drill, the more reps you get, just the better you get. So make sure to stay tuned for more videos.